Oh my goodness. So here we are. I actually realized that the game wasn't recording. Crap baskets. This is the second setback we've had for this episode. So hopefully, first off, this episode gets out there. Second of all, it is election day here in the state, so things are a little bit crazy right now. Indeed, very crazy. And thankfully, in this game, we ain't got to deal with it, so it is never election day. I'm just in charge of this game, which may be a good thing for these guys, uh, civilians, to say the least. But yes, we've been having a very successful run here so far. We actually built a stadium and the Statue of Liberty, which we'll take a look at here real soon. So the stadium, we don't know what's going on. It's just got, what, two visitors last week, two tourists last week. City provides smoke detectors for its residents. Thankfully, they're right there by the stadium. And of course, we got a, a dump right here, which we're gonna have to go ahead and move. Oh, we can't move you just yet. We'll have to empty you. So we'll have to empty you at some point. The stadium's right near, oh my goodness, all the in industry. So they're gonna be breathing in that smog. That's funny. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So yes, yeah, so what do we got? We have bus lines and such. We should have subways now too, right? Metro stations and such. That's good. Trains and such. There we go. Now the reason why this didn't originally record was because OBS had crashed and I didn't realize it. Talk about the ultimate pain in the butt. So I have to keep an eye and be more mindful of it this time. I had just gotten to Capital City. We are officially a capital city now. It's been a while since we've gotten this. So I do want to put a shipyard around here too. So there's cargo shipyard and a harbor. So this harbor provides outside connections for passengers to the city by sea. Tourists arrive by the city and leave via the harbor. Place the harbor on a seaside location where a harbor and around. Okay, so that's good. If we put a harbor up top here. This will allow. Okay, so what? Yeah, they can leave via that way. Okay, that's cool. They'll have our tourists come all the way through the sea to the harbor. And what about, hold on, what about this one? This one be for a commercial, right? Cargo Harbor. Ships out goods and brings in materials to industry and power plants. This is good. We need this. Place the Cargo Harbor in a seaside location where a harbor route is available. So, yes. Let's do this because this will help bring in coal and oil and such for our plants we do have. And we'll put them right by the stinky plant because you know what? Whatever. They'll just have to get over it. Maybe we'll plant, like, a harbor here for our residents to come by. Oh, it is so tricky. It is so tricky. Okay, whatever, to say the least. So, what was missed in the crash footage while I was doing this was that, yeah, we had the Statue of Liberty here. How we doing? Tourists, 102 tourists last week. Tourists, yeah, visitors last week. Two tourists last week. Oh, my goodness. I'm so excited for this episode that... It really bums me out. It glitched. The OBS should get me very upset sometimes. So you can see our residential area is building up very nicely in our high residential. We may have to build more schools for that, by the way. Stadium, we got... It's picking up a little bit there. It's good. I still wish we could have, like, a sports team or something there that can actually take advantage of it. Like, you can get the llamas or something, you know? We need the llamas! No, oh, wait a minute. Not enough workers. Oh, my goodness. So, here we go. We're going to need some more residents here soon. All right, we're going to start pushing over this way, too, because we don't want to get that smog near the stadium, because if you get people getting sick from that, that is going to be very unfortunate. Okay, hold on. You're what, a three-lane three lane road here, right? So let's just go with six-lane road here, whatever. I just want to run you over here for right. There we go. Then we'll bring a two-lane road. Oh, don't do that, please. Thank you. We'll bring it like a two-lane road up from here. There we go. And then I want to have this lane or this road, whatever, go over to here. There we go. Then we can actually run like little side streets and such over to the other ways. Actually, hold on. No, I think this will work out. And then we'll just be like, whop. And then we'll just be like, eh, yoink. And we're not going to make this every one because we don't have too many intersections. Too many intersections are actually very bad. We don't want to slow traffic down like before. And then, you know what? Boop. Boop, boop. Sometimes we'll just have to eat the space that's left. And then, there we go. Alright, so this isn't exactly the most fanciest ways of doing this, but whatever. So yes, people are out today here, 
because it's election day and they are crazy, 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 crazy. It's cool though to be a part of it. I already went out and voted. I'm not going to say who I voted for because, yeah, we don't want to have that discussion. We have a flame war. Either way though, if you're of age and you haven't, you know, you've got to vote. It's part of the process and good things like that. I know both candidates, both major candidates aren't my favorite candidates to vote for. I mean, quite frankly, it's a bummer, but it is what it is. Gotta do what you gotta do, even when it's not pretty. Then you take a doo-doo on it. Okay, I tried with that one. I didn't know much else where to go with it, seriously. But again, at least with this game, we ain't gonna worry about Election Day. Now, in SimCity, like the classic SimCities, they did have a system where you could be voted out of office and you lost the game that way. For those older players who may remember, like, SimCity, the original, and SimCity 2000, Maybe even 3,000. I think it was 2,000, though. They had stopped it, where you could actually be voted out or something. So that was kind of, like, weird, but it was a thing. Oh, no! We have a death! No! Oh, we got death over at the Statue of Liberty. Somebody take care of that. Oh, my. Yeah, things are getting very busy with our death count again. We need to start doing something about that. It's not good. People are dying. Yeah. So we need to go ahead and do this. Now we've gotten us taken care of. Oh, gosh. Fill bucket. Fill bucket tool. There we go. Never seen so many people die so much in a town like this. There we go. Keep on building. Keep on keeping on. Maybe this is... Maybe this will be enough for now. I don't know. We'll see. Slap a couple more in there. All right, Rock. You're not... You're not what we want here, Rock. Get out of here. These rocks. Get out of here. And get out of yeah. Finally. Right, so much better. So this was actually like my first election I've actually taken part in. Again, I'm not going to say who I voted for, but it was kind of cool to actually be a part of it. I don't know, we'll see. Again, it wasn't exactly the candidates I preferred. You can actually vote third party, but to be honest, here in the States, we, they don't really take third party very seriously. And that's very unfortunate because, again, I think there were some people who have some really good stuff to offer. There was some good common sense there. Again, it's very unfortunate. So hopefully it's something we could deal with one day and work work out because I feel like good people get missed out just because they don't take one of the major parties. But I'm not making this political. We're moving on. Good things and such. Jeez. I do have to say this is probably one of the more, like, heavy-weighted Elections and Lord knows how long. So, <laughs> at least I can say I took part of it. Okay, so now, yeah. If I haven't mentioned this before, I think it's maybe in lost footage. That I did add on to this area before a little bit, so you can see that we have offices down here that are growing. Very good to see. We have commercial growing over here, more office space. A nice little high value residency right down here. And now that we. Oh my goodness, I forgot. Did I didn't even give you roadways. I was so excited, I didn't even give you guys roadways. That is terrible. Yeah, we gave you that, but you have, like, no access, and you have, like, no access to water. That is most unfortunate. So, we need to fix that. Oh, my gosh. Talk about the ultimate bonehead experience. That's what I did. Hold on. You know what? You know what? Just do that. Fine. I'm gonna run some water all the way over. There we go. Good stuff. I'm sorry. No wonder you're not getting stuff in. There was no connection. Jeez. Speed up the process. There we go. You got your water. Come on. Hustle. Hustle. Bring me some stuff. We need things. We need good things. Bring me some good things. So at least the good thing about not having elections in this game is we ain't gotta worry about any Trumps or Clintonisms or anything else like that. <laughs> Faulty emails and... Oh my goodness, I don't even want to go any further into that mess. Congratulations to us! Mayor has announced that our beautiful city won the most attractive city award! Happy Mayor Alert! Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, so what? I see you over there with that. Somebody is complaining about trash. So what we need to do about that, since I'm sure things are getting hectic over here, we need to make another trash thingy. Another trash thingy. So, landfill please. Right, this is going to have vast impact on commercial over here, but that's fine. I'm good with that because, quite frankly, it's commercial. Don't worry about them, you know? 
They'll just deal with it. Now at some point we'll have to go ahead and build another incinerator too, but... Death, death, death. We gotta worry about death. Alright, so average health, 67%. Hospitals are actually very good. We've got a capacity of 700. We only gotta worry about that many sick citizens. Awesome. What about dying? The crematorium's got plenty of capacity. Our cemetery usage is getting a little bit close, but we can deal with that. Oh my goodness. There's a weird smell. I know because of all this traffic. These people are crazy. The building is burned down. How many buildings burn down? Oh my goodness. Okay, hold on. So, do that. Get you out of the way. Fire protection is one thing we are clearly struggling on as long as well as dealing with dying people. Alright, so we're going to put a crematorium over here. Hopefully we're putting more hearses and things on the road to deal with this, but at the same time, I don't know, the roads themselves may have an issue that's, that's causing this. Alright, so let me see some of these roads. Okay, this is the one road. Yeah, this is one road in itself. And this is one road in itself, so it's actually, what, a two-lane? Is that a two-lane road? No, that's a one lane. Okay, we had to buff this up here. This is like a main thoroughfare, so hold on, go back. Yeah, that is like a major thoroughfare. So much is going on here with these. Oh my goodness. Look at all these people. You know, we, we're going to have to change something. These small roads are not meant for this. Oh my, look at these dead people. I see dead people everywhere. All right, hold on. I hate to do this because this is going to lose commercial. I mean, it, this is going to lose residential people. But, folks, we are not geared for this. No, see, this is the problem. When these areas were like little small houses, it was nothing to worry about. But now that they're like bigger places, oh, okay, there was a. Is that fire? Oh my gosh. But yeah, see, now that it happened, it's a major problem. It's a pause. We, we can't do this just yet. We gotta move the school, right? Yes. There we go. Upgrade the road. So, by doing this, it'll be much better. There we go. And then move you back, right? There we go. Much better. Again, this, this is gonna cause us to lose a lot of people. But in the end, it's going to be worth it. It's one of those things you got to do. You like, like going to the dentist. You don't want to do it. You're afraid to do it, but you got to do it. The only difference is I'm just too afraid to go to the dentist. Thankfully, I've had no major issues so far. Except maybe getting my wisdom teeth pulled, but I'm just too chicken to do that. It, it's a thing. Don't be chicken, even though I'm chicken. So, wait a minute. Space already occupied. What? Okay, something is like causing problems. Hold on. Yeah, I want to upgrade the road. No, I wanted to upgrade the road. Why are we not upgrading the roads? Unless there's something here we can't upgrade. What? Yeah, I get the feeling. Hold on. High school's an issue. Okay. High school, we're going to move you over here. I hate to do that, but... Again, we really can't upgrade the roads there because it's being a pain in the butt. Oh, jeez. See, there's a park in the way. Jeez. Yeah, I forgot how much stuff we have, like, literally spliced in here. Move you. Now the park's across the street. There we go. Very good stuff. Upgrade. There we go. Awesome. And, uh, what? Oh, because of that. Oh, my goodness. The, the struggles of dealing with all this stuff. Okay, so, fill bucket you. Fill bucket activates. Fill bucket and everything. Now we've got these gaps here. I don't even know why we got these gaps here. We're gonna fix them. There we go. Fixing all gaps. Fixing all gaps. That's because we had buildings burned down. It's weird. Why would they burn down with these zone? I do not understand that. That's kind of awkward. To each their own, I suppose. There we go. Now, can we have some growth here, please? We need a little bit of growth. Oh my goodness, that is a traffic jam! Again, this is where having too many roads is going to cause an issue because look at all these little road things here. These little intersections. Now, we may have to find a permanent solution to do to, from that because, again, too many intersections are terrible. 
Oh, butt nuggets. Okay. Well, either way. In the end, we got ourselves a stadium, which is good. Unfortunately, we did not capture it because, well, things happen. Oh, well, we lost a lot of money per week. Down to 4,000. That'll come back up there when we get more people. We'll get more people back. Uh, we got a Statue of Liberty up here, which, again, we captured off screen. We did get ourselves a port, so that's good. We're getting goods and services. How are we doing? Allow ships to carry goods and raw material to and from the city, which is good. Again, our materials are doing great. Electricity should be doing wonderful. Right. Consumption. We are producing a ton of electricity right now. That is not a problem. That was very beneficial for all of our stuff, so... Done that, right? You guys good? Not enough fuel? Don't worry, we're gonna have more for you coming. I promise, it's gonna be huge. Okay, oil power plant, good for nine weeks, that's awesome. That's good for two weeks. So, when the trucks and all start coming in, you guys should be good. What are, what are they doing out there? They're like doing the Samba. Okay, one comes in, one goes out, no one's going out. Okay. What about you? Oh, you're loading! You're selling stuff out, okay. That's kind of weird. Oh, come back! I want to see what you got. Okay, you got 100% load. Cargo Harbor. This one's bringing stuff in. Cool. Owner, Lakefield. Bless you, Lakefield! And all you're worth! Unless you're, you're giving me oil, and then maybe you're good. Come on, Lakefield, get in here! Pretty bad we're sitting here watching a cargo ship come in. Lakefield, you better give me something good! <laughs> the boat just slams into harbor, too. Just like... And, of course, he took stuff out, too. Either way... That's it, so... Not too bad at all. Not too shabby. We'll get some more people here. Don't worry, we got more people coming. For some reason... Oh, my goodness, we are having a problem with the buildings burning down. So, some of this modular stuff may not have been a good idea, because, quite frankly, the intersections here are... are tumultuous, to say the least. But, getting more tr uh, wider roads here can probably help a little. Oh my goodness. We may have to upgrade more roads. Them little smaller roads aren't cutting no more. The video's over, but there's more where that came from. Be sure to subscribe for more Terraria Let's Plays, Top 5s, and other videos as well as we cover different titles. You can click on one of the videos here for more. Be sure to rate this video accordingly as it helps the channel out greatly. Have yourself a wonderful day, and I will see you again next time.